Hi guys, so today I decided to shoot this AIDS makeup tutorial for you guys. It's just this really pretty cranberry halo eye. But yeah, if you like the look, keep on watching. Okay, hey guys, so to start I'm removing these eye patches from my eyes because my bags were extra puffy this morning. And I'm just massaging in some eye cream on top of that. And now I'm going in with my trusty Makeup Forever corrector. And I'm just applying that under my eyes, around my nose, and around my mouth. Just anywhere that's extra dark. And now onto foundation. Of course, I'm using the NARS Sheer Glow and some Bootleg Beauty Blender. No, I'm kidding. I think this is like some shoe Humera. Um, I don't know. And I'm just massaging that into my skin. I just realized that it was not giving me enough coverage at all, so... I went on top and I just massaged it in with my hands. Just like such. I honestly, I feel like the NARS Sheer Glow looks significantly better when it's applied with the hands. And now I'm just going and re-blending that out with this... I don't even know what to call it. Sponge? Okay, sponge. That'd be smart. And now it's concealer. Um, I'm using a new one today. Uh, my best friend gave it to me. It's from Glossier. Yeah, she's like a really nice medium coverage concealer, but it has a very like pretty dewy finish. And onto the eyes, and prepping with the Smashbox 24 Hour Primer, and I'm using the Modern Renaissance Palette from Anastasia. So excited! First color I'm using is raw sienna. It's just like a burnt orange co color, and I'm pretty much just applying that into my crease, and I'm gonna be using that as kind of like a transition shade. I found that the brush that came with the palette was super, like, not good. <laughs> like, it was just very... The bristles kept coming off onto my eye. I kept having to, like, pause and clean it up. And now I'm going on w in with Red Ochre. It's just, like, a really pretty deep matte cranberry shade. And so this is pretty much a halo eye look. So what we're going to be doing is applying at the front of the eye and at the end of the eye and leaving that center part free until we apply a shimmery shade. So right now I'm just pretty much blending in the red ochre and the raw sienna and I'm doing the same on the other eye. And now onto the bottom. To start, I'm just applying raw sienna under the eye area. And then I pretty much, oh my god, I got cut out. But I pretty much just did the same thing I did on the top lids. I applied red ochre to the outside and the inside of my lower lash line. And now I'm just going in with my Stila Golden Topaz on a wet brush just to give it extra pigment. And I'm applying that to that center area that we left free. And I'm doing the exact same on the bottom eye. And I'm taking, oh my god, I don't even know what it's called, but it's the lightest shimmery shade from the palette. And I'm applying that over top of the center of the lid into my tear duct. And now I'm applying Cypress Umber and I'm pretty much just using that to create a bit of depth. I'm applying it pretty much closest to the lash line. And blending it out so everything looks very seamless. Now I'm just going to apply bottom mascara and I'm going to curl my upper lashes to prep them for falsies. And the falsies I'm going to be using today are the Huda Beauty Sophia Lashes. I'm just applying them with a tweezer and duo glue. And 
And now I'm just applying some bronzer. The bronzer I'm using is the Guerlain Terracotta. And now I'm using the Glow Kit from Anastasia. So I wasn't going to put a blush because I feel like I went pretty heavy on the eyes, but I decided to just put the lip color that I'm wearing on my cheeks just so it ties the look together. I do this a lot, like I always apply my lipstick to my cheeks. I love it. It gives you such a creamy, natural finish as well. And now I'm using my stub of a lip liner to line my lips. And I'm going in with the MAC Velvet Teddy Lipstick and I'm just applying that onto my lips. So I decided I wanted to do a little bit of gloss so I'm just using some Buxom like 100 point perk that I got from work. And I'm just finishing up with some setting spray and that is it. There we have the finished look. Aid Mubarak guys! <laughs>